Yeah, okay, we'll do this. Hey everyone, before we get started, I know that alliances now exist. And uh, I initially just had it open to members who were also in our Discord. Uh, so if, if you want to check that out, you can check out the thing down there. Just use that ID number, I guess. <laughs> if you want to join, it's pretty laid back. We don't really do, like, a lot of coordination. It's kind of just pick up when you can play type situations. So if you're down, uh, feel free to join it. There's a handful of us in there already, um, but we do have some slots open, and it's kind of on a first-come, first-served basis. So if you get a chance, uh, you can do that. Now on to the summon video. Okay, so I initially wasn't going to summon on this. Uh, but then I saw that it was a light banner. And y'all know I love my light banners. Uh, I'm not the biggest fan of Cleo, and I'm only salty because I would have much rather had Summer Ellie. But that's okay. That's fine. Uh, I don't actually have a healer, a shadow healer, outside of Cleo, like regular Cleo. So I guess this is fine. Like, this will all work out. I could use another light dragon. Why not? So let's just, let's go for it. Um, I have used my freebie and uh, my reduced one already today. So uh, we're starting off at a two pole already, which is very exciting. Except for the fact that we don't really get anything. <laughs> Except for the fact that we just got a dupe. But I'll take the Eldwater. Like I said, I'm never, never am I against uh, Eldwater. Eldwater is a beautiful thing. It allows you to buy worm prints. It allows you to fill out the last tier of your um, unbinding. There's all kinds of good things that you can use Eldwater for, and so I'm I'm always happy to to get some. Uh, I don't know if I want to do. I don't know if I want to do eighteen singles and then two tenfolds. I'm torn. I'm torn because I don't know what the odds are mostly like I don't know I don't know if the odds are but like four and a half to five percent is that really gonna make a big difference on a tenfold you know I I don't know I'm always torn I'm always torn with that I think it's I think it's literally just psychological I don't think there's really any benefit <laughs> to doing it let me move this there we go. So I can actually like look at the screen. There's a four. We could get um, Luca. We could get Luca, but we're not. We're getting a dragon or a unicorn. <laughs> Unicorns can be dragons too. It's 2019. Oh dear. So yeah, summer part two. Welcome, Dragale Lost. Also, sorry I didn't have graphics up in the last summon. <laughs> I just noticed. I noticed I didn't, that wasn't a thing that I had, and I apologize for that. Um, I don't know where they went. They just kind of disappeared. I think I maybe moved the file um, before I record. Like, I set up my layout beforehand, and then I moved the actual graphic. Uh, so OBS didn't know where to pull from. It was just like, WTF, mate. Um, which is totally on me. <laughs> so... I take full responsibility for that. But we have graphics up this time. Hooray! Uh, so that's that's good stuff. Alright, so am I at... I'm like one away? Yeah, I'm one away. I'm one away from increased rates here. So we'll give it a shot. Might as well. Maybe. No. Fair enough. Fair enough. So I know I don't talk a whole lot about Dragalian Lost. Um, I kind of just play it on my own, very casual-like. Um, I, I'm trying to get ready for the, uh, the High Dragon Trials, because I have not paid attention to those whatsoever. No rainbows! No rainbows for us, friends. Feels bad. Might get a Luka, though. I see some Wearmite. Or not Wearmite, sorry. Eldwater. And so that is, that is exciting in its own own right. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to get ready for High Dragon Trials. Obviously we have the 
alliance now. I think I have you. I do have you. Oh, double. Uh, she is increased rates in case you were wondering. Why I just got double of her. Makes sense. Okay. So a lot of Eldwater. We just got a lot of Eldwater. Which is cool because I just purchased the prince uh, from this. Alright, so I guess... No, didn't didn't take the first time. We got questionable. Alright, we got a fiver this time. Maybe multiples, who knows? Could be... Nope, just the one. Nah, just the one, though. Nah, but for real, just the one, though. Um, I don't really know... Ooh, okay. So we got a, uh, we got a dragon friend. Shocking, I know. I've been in, like, full-blown dragon mode lately. I don't know what the deal is. Um, when it comes to, when it comes to five stars, I should, I should clarify. When it comes to five stars, I am in, like, full-blown dragon mode for whatever reason. Don't know what the deal is. Can't get adventurers to save my life of the five star. I don't think I have Prometheus. I think he's new. I think he's new. And we got Summer Luca. Okay. That's fine. I'll take a Summer Luca. Summer Luca seems pretty good at what he does, I guess. Still sad it's not Elisan, but that's okay. That's alright. We got a Fire Dragon, which is not a Light Dragon. Uh, so we got Strength and Wind Res. So I guess that's kind of helpful. I tend to lean more towards the dragons that just like buff your strength a whole bunch. But that's fine too, I guess. I guess. <laughs> I suppose that's fine. Uh, and it's it's somebody we didn't have before, so we get a little Wormite off of that. Or Wearmite. Sorry, Wearmite. So that's fine. It is what it is. Alright, so now we're doing... Some ticky tickets here. So maybe I should, maybe I should pull 20. Maybe we should do 20 singles. Maybe that's the play. Maybe that's the play. Maybe I've been a fool this entire time. Maybe that's what I should be doing. I have a message. Okay. All right. Fingers crossed. We could also... I guess it does make sense to do 20 and then 10s. I guess that does make more sense. You got me. You got me, side games. You got me. It makes more sense to do that because... I don't know. You have a... I mean, that's a lot of single pulls that you might get something from, too. You know? I also feel as though the game might intentionally go out of its way to break me early as I'm trying to build up an extensive pity rate. Uh, why do I think gotchas are always against me? That's a good question. I don't know that I have an answer for you. I wish I did, but I don't. Also getting ready for uh, Choose Your Legends, which I think, I think I'm putting this out on Tuesday. I think I'm putting this out on Tuesday. Um, so that means Wednesday or tomorrow. There's a Luca. Um, we are, uh, probably getting a trailer. For Choose Your Legends. And I know that, um, I know we've seen some of them so far, but I'm pretty sure we get, like, a traditional New Heroes kind of trailer, uh, to go along with them. So I'm kind of, kind of trying to space some stuff out. Little, little by little here. Alright, I think we're going to do 20. Because see, something like that's going to happen. The only downside is that now we kind of start all over again. But that's fine. Guess that's fine. Hey! Alright, so the uh, siren, this siren, the previous siren was just showcase bait for this siren uh the dragon on here she's actually kind of worth i think 
based on what I've seen a buzz um, she's kind of like another Cupid but she gets this going uh, which is which is super nice the buffs are very nice Cupid heals but she kind of buffs uh, which I'm a huge fan of obviously um, because I, I don't play passive. It's There's no fun. <laughs> what is healing? I don't even know. Uh, I just like to smash things. Which usually results in me getting killed a lot. Um, I mean, I guess we just keep going. I guess we just keep going, man. We're on 25. So when we get to 5 tickets, I guess we'll just go for it. And see what we can do here. I'm apprehensive. Uh... To, to kind of lean into my worm might stash right now because um, there is a one year anniversary coming up pretty soon I think this game launched in October or like late September uh, of last year and so they're you know we're like eight ish weeks off from getting a, an anniversary and for those of you guys who have played this, if you haven't, I'm so sorry. I hope it comes to your country and or region soon. Um, but for those of you who have played it, uh, Psy Games, or any Psy Games for that matter, um, any Psy Games game, I should say, uh, Psy Games is very, very generous. Like, just in general. And then, more exceptionally so, when it comes to anniversary stuff. So... I'm... Oh, hello. Was that a... <laughs> Another dragon! Levy! Oh, but I already have you max unbound, bro! Oh, no! Yeah, he's max unbound already. Dang! I think. I think. Hold on. Hold that thought. Hold that thought for me. Hold that thought for me. Yeah, max on down. All right. Yeah, okay. Well, we have two Leviathans now. I guess that's where we're at. <laughs> that's where we're at. So so far, uh, we've burned two tickets and about or two ten full tickets and about twenty single tickets, right? Ish. And uh, we've gotten three five star dragons. <laughs> One of which uh, was the focus dragon. So there's that, I guess. I would, <laughs> I wish we could, uh, I wish we could get some more focus stuff, um, even some more of the uh, sirens. Tbh, that would be nice. Having having a couple um, merges on her would be good. But we'll take what we can get. We'll take what we can get. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna, you know, be that guy. I did tweet out that I was, like, semi-disappointed, but that's only... Let me clarify, because I know that people love Cleo. I totally get it. Well, I don't actually get it. I don't I don't particularly see the appeal of Cleo. In the comments, let me know. What is so great about Cleo that you particularly like about her? Because I... I don't know. Like, I just think she's okay. There's nothing spectacular, I guess, is how I would put it. Um... <laughs> but I was disappointed that we had yet another Cleo. Like, if... Like, Summer Cleo's totally fine. I I guess I'm more disappointed with the timing of Gala Cleo, who was, like, literally two weeks ago, if that. Could have been sooner, I think. Um, but that was that was my main thing. Because uh, what happens, and it's ha it happened in Heroes pretty frequently the first, like, year and a half to two years... Um, they'd release a lot of characters with alts being the same character. Camilla and Lynn, for example, if you play uh, Fire Emblem Heroes, you know what that means. And they released them pretty close together, uh, and that was like two months apart. <laughs> but now, you know, it's like literally two weeks and we have another Cleo alt. And I was just like, oh, it's kind of a bummer, you know? But, I mean, I, I guess... With the release of High Jupiter and having Galacleo come out, like, kind of for that. I get it. 
Like, I understand it. I get the logic behind it. Um, it's just... It's dis disappointing timing, I guess. I'm not disappointed in the characters the units. I'm mostly sad about the timing. <laughs> if that makes any sense at all. Um, but, I don't know. If you saw that on Twitter and you thought I was mad, I'm not mad. I'm just, I'm just disappointed. <laughs> I'm parent mad. I'm disappointed. <laughs> I'm disappointed by the timing of the releases. Um... Especially for people who like Cleo. Like, that's gotta really suck. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because, like, you probably dumped a bunch of your Wormite and stuff into Galacleo. And if you didn't get her, you are now, like, not very likely to be able to summon or you have to, like, pay to play. And there's another one of your favorite characters that's also, you know, that you just burned your entire stash for to try and get. Not yet, you know what I mean? So, it's... It's, it's unfortunate for Cleo fans, but at the same time, if you were lucky on the last one, then you probably feel pretty good about this. <laughs> it's a whole mix of emotions, you know? It's, it's a whole thing. It's a whole thing. Um, but I'm happy for the Cleo fans, I guess. Summer Ellie. We'll, we'll always have Summer Ellie in the castle stories, I guess. That's the way to look at it. How are we looking over here? Alright, so nine more. So we did have a break. Yes. Kind of. Well, Cleo agrees. Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm so not used to playing with the uh, uh, the voices on. I don't know. I feel like I'm one of the few people who don't use the player voices. Like, I'll keep music and uh, sound effects on. But, I don't know. I Some of the character voices are a little much. Like, there's only so much grunting of, like, Halloween Ellie that I can listen to before I'm like, Alright, Ellie, calm down. <laughs> it ain't that serious. Stop. Uh, I don't know what number we're on. Maybe we are on 25. Maybe we gotta take the 5. I think we gotta take the 5. I can't remember if uh, Leviathan broke us or what happened with that. I cannot recall. What up, Cinder Drake? Buddy. You will be sold soon. Alright, so we need six more? Six more. So five more after this, I guess, is how I should remember that. Alright, so we need five more. So we gotta take it down to two tickets. That's that's the play. So we did get broken. We got, well, not broken. We got interrupted. <laughs> Leviathan interrupted us. He didn't break us, necessarily. Oh, I also have new glasses, by the way. I don't know if you noticed. I can't remember the last time I did a video with a webcam. I can't remember. Because I've done a couple that haven't used it, and I had some pre-recorded. And I got glasses, like, in the middle of all that. Um, so I have new glasses. <laughs> That's the only other thing that's really going on with me at the moment. Uh, new glasses, getting ready for Choose Your Legends. Oh, I will be at the Pokemon World Championships this weekend. So that's a thing. Uh, I'm probably going to be playing Fire Emblem Three Houses and handing out Cypher cards to my mutuals or people that I just know enjoy Fire Emblem. Uh, there's that. <laughs> that will be happening this weekend. I'm actually, it's kind of crazy, which not to talk about heroes. Ooh, ooh. No, okay. I thought maybe it was gonna like psych us out, you know what I mean? But it didn't. It didn't psych us out. Best water healer right there. Best water healer. Alright, what are we at? One more. One more! One! One more to go. And then we'll do like a tenfold, I guess, until we get a five star. That's how I'm gonna play this. Because <laughs> I guess this is also not limited. Which is kind of bonkers. Um, but anyway, not to talk about Fire Emblem Heroes too much, but... Uh, in order to get the <laughs> Choose Your Legends banner out on time, um, I am actually going to wake up at 3 a.m., record it when it's live, and um, <laughs> we're going to head to the, ch the Pokemon World Championships like immediately follow. Ooh, we got one. We got broken by something. I feel like we did. 
I think we did. Oh, we didn't. Oh, okay, cool. I thought I saw a rainbow thing. I must. I'm. I'm just tripping. Don't pay attention. Here. Um. Yeah. So I'm gonna go to sleep super early on Thursday. <laughs> Wake up wicked late on Friday. Or early, I guess. Go to bed early, wake up early. I guess that's technically how you would say it correctly. Um, hey, buddy. Oof. All right. Okay. Um, and then we'll uh, we'll have that up on release day because uh, I'm mostly super excited about that. Wow, bro. For real though. Oh, there it is. Please. <laughs> One. Oh, but it looked like a. I don't. I didn't see what it was. Was it a staff? Yeah, it's a staff. So we're getting a healer, and it is Verica. Okay. So Verica is kind of the one that I was mostly after because I don't really like outside of regular Cleo. I don't have anybody to heal. Uh, in in the shadowy teens. So um, I'm good with that. I'm genuinely pretty good with that. Because I never got um, the Scholar guy when he came out with the library facility event thing. I never got him. Hey! Also a good healer. I'm a fan of his too. Alright, so we got Verica, which is dope. No Cleo. Shocking. I'm also a little bitter about Cleo because I tried like hell to get her in uh, the Dragon Yule event and it just didn't happen. <laughs> I burned through a lot of Wormite for that girl and she just refused to show up. Uh, so, take that. Um, so I'm not bringing up a Cleo. Or, wait. Cleo is not bringing up with me. I'm bringing up a Cleo. Uh, so there, Cleo. Um, alright, so we got some Blind Rose, which is good. I think she has... Yes. Alright, so... Her first, uh, her first special, this Everlasting Summer, um, when it's not full and you use Moment of Passion, uh, it causes the Everlasting Summer gauge to fill gradually. Which is kind of nice. Which is a cool little side effect there. Um, so I'm a fan of that. Um, and overall, just in general, you know, I, I'm not, I'm not so up on the healers. Uh, don't even get me started about uh, Hildy and Valentine. I don't want to talk about the Valentine's banner. This is a safe space. You're not going to go back to that. Um, but anyway. That was funny. <laughs> All right. Well, hey, let me know. I am aware. I know. It's been brought to my attention. Uh, that's actually, you know what? You know what I'm going to do? Hold on. There we go. All right. So in the comments, let me know, uh, A, if you like Cleo and why, and B, how your summoning did on this. Uh, reminder that these guys are in the normal pool. Um, they are not limited units. I don't think the previous summer banner was either. The part one. This this one. This one. I don't think these guys are limited either. Um, which is crazy. There's a lot of stuff happening that's not limited. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared for what they're about to hit us with, the, with that is limited. Um, but anyway, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Good luck if you are summoning. If not, happy Wearmite saving. And uh, that's it for now. So thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you next time.